Imagine waking up one morning and stepping outside only to find the world as you know it, gone. The streets you walked, the buildings you frequented, all swallowed by the relentless sea. This isn't science fiction. What if sea levels rose, not by a few feet, but by a thousand meters? Buckle up, because we're about to explore a world reshaped by water. Picture this. The Statue of Liberty, once a beacon of freedom, now submerged. The Eiffel Tower, gone. Skyscrapers of New York, Tokyo, Dubai, swallowed by the sea. A thousand meter surge would leave only the highest mountain peaks visible. Our planet would become a watery expanse dotted with lonely summits. Farmland would transform into abyssal plains and continents lost to the depths. It's about losing the foundation of our civilization. In this new world, survival would be a privilege, not a right. The lucky few who reached the island peaks faced a struggle for existence. Limited resources and dwindling supplies made every day a fight for survival. And what of those who couldn't reach safety? The casualties were beyond comprehension, a stark reminder of life's fragility. Forget global warming, we'd be talking about global weirding. This massive influx of water into the atmosphere would throw our climate system into disarray. Weather patterns would become unpredictable and extreme. Imagine superstorms of unimaginable ferocity, fueled by the increased evaporation from a planet covered in water. The delicate balance that governs Earth's climate would be shattered, leading to a period of climatic chaos, the likes of which our species has never witnessed. Chapter 4 an ecosystem adrift. Life on Earth is a web of interconnected ecosystems, each dependent on the other. A thousand meter sea level rise wouldn't just disrupt this web, it would shred it to pieces. Terrestrial ecosystems would be wiped out, their inhabitants drowned beneath the waves. Marine ecosystems wouldn't fare much better. The sudden influx of fresh water would wreak havoc on salinity levels, leading to mass die-offs and the collapse of food chains. The oceans, once teeming with life, would become vast, silent graveyards. Chapter 5. A planet reshaped. The Earth's crust, that seemingly solid ground beneath our feet, is surprisingly malleable. The immense weight of all that extra water would press down on the ocean basins, causing them to sink further. This, in turn, could trigger earthquakes, volcanic eruptions and tsunamis, reshaping the planet's surface in cataclysmic ways. Ocean currents, those underwater rivers that regulate our climate, would be thrown into disarray. The Gulf Stream, that engine of warmth for the North Atlantic, could grind to a halt, plunging Europe into a deep freeze. Chapter 6. A New Marine World Life is tenacious, always finding a way. Oceans become the cradle of a new evolutionary saga. Marine life adapts, evolving new forms and behaviours, new ecosystems emerge, uniquely suited to this world. Chapter 7. Lost to the Depths What would become of humanity's legacy in this drowned world? Cities would become underwater ruins, monuments to a lost civilization. Books, art, technology, all the artifacts of our existence would be lost to the depths, leaving future generations, if any, to piece together the story of our rise and fall. The knowledge we've accumulated over millennia would vanish beneath the waves, a sobering thought that underscores the preciousness and fragility of our intellectual inheritance. Chapter 8. A Wobbly Future Believe it or not, adding that much water to the Earth wouldn't just change the landscape. It could actually mess with our planet's rotation. The distribution of Earth's mass influences its spin, and a sudden shift like this could alter the length of a day, even tilt our planet's axis. Imagine, longer days, shorter nights, or even seasons gone haywire. Talk about an astronomical makeover. This seemingly far-out consequence highlights how interconnected our planet's systems truly are. Outro a watery wake-up call. Relax, we're not about to be swallowed by a global flood anytime soon. This thousand-meter sea-level rise scenario purely hypothetical, a thought experiment designed to make you think. But even though it's unlikely, it throws into sharp relief just how interconnected and fragile our planet's systems really are. Even small changes in sea level can have a ripple effect, impacting everything from coastal communities to global weather patterns.